need a space. Show us how well you did. Wow. Wow. That is amazing. Oh, this one has a bonus effect. You see this, Nicole? Bonus effect. The bottom card is now the three of clubs. <laughs> Go ahead, take a look. Oh my God. <laughs> you guys are too good. Step three, magician waves the fourth ace over the deck. So magician, you take the last ace, turn it face up, and wave it over the deck. And here's the part that gets me. Show the three aces are now back on top of the deck. <laughs> so, that works every time, but somehow. <laughs> When a young magician begins learning some of the magic tricks that I've been showing you, it's hard to keep track of the tricks that you've learned and exactly how they work. So a lot of beginner magic sets will give you a card like this. It's just a crib sheet, sort of a cheat sheet for three card tricks that you can do. And it just breaks down the steps so that you can remember if you want to show someone a trick but you can't, you don't quite have it down yet. And these are all self-working card tricks. You can see it says, right there self-working card tricks cheat sheet and all of the tricks are self-working and, and pretty easy to accomplish so with that in mind i'm going to have you be the magician nicole and i'm going to be the spectator i'm so excited so you're going to do the trick for me so the first step it says magician shuffles cards so you can mix right. those up And that is one fancy shuffle right there. Right. Look at this. All right, great, perfect. Next step is a spectator selects a card, returns it to the deck, and shuffles the deck. So I'm the spectator, so spread them out for me like a magician and say, pick any card. Pick a card, any card. Perfect. And this will be the one. <laughs> All right, now you look away while I show everyone the card. All right, you guys see that? Okay, perfect. All right, you can close up the deck. And next says, um, spec oh, spectator selects card, returns it to the deck, and shuffles the deck. So we'll put the card back uh, right about the middle, and we'll give them uh, a quick little shuffle. And uh, step three says, spectator, spectator deals, deals until magician says stop. Perfect. I'm the spectator, so yeah. I'm gonna deal. You just say stop, stop. any, oh, right here. Mm -hmm. I was about to deal this one down. Do you want it down yeah, or do you want it on top? Down. Down. All right, and you don't wanna go further, you could if you'd like, it's up to you. Okay, the next step says, uh, magician deals five more cards. So go ahead and deal right five more this? cards right onto it. this, yeah. Step five says, have spectator name the card and reveal the last card dealt to. Oh. My card was the Queen of Spades, is that right? Yep. The Queen of Spades. Show us how well you did. Wow. wow. That is amazing. <laughs> how did you do that? And, 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 and that's the... And that's the <laughs> wow, you guys are awesome. And that's these tricks. They're self-working. Uh, some of them are mathematical principles. Um, so would that have worked even if you were the spectator? I think it would have. Would it? That's cool. um, it's amazing, isn't it? <laughs> Jake, we'll try another one if you don't mind helping out. That would be great. This is um, this one is it says cut to card. Some of these just have the most basic titles, and. Um, the first step, again, is Magician Shuffles cards. So you're gonna be the magician for this. I'll be the spectator, you can shuffle those or just cut them so they're mixed up and they're in no particular order. Step two, just like before, is uh, Spectator selects a card. So you can spread them for me to pick a card. I'm the spectator, you're the magician. Spread all of them? Yeah, oh yeah, perfect. Right on the table's fine, we'll pick any one. Nicole, which one should we take? That one. All right, this one here. Mm -hmm. All right, so you can fix these up, Jake. And um, Nicole, just me and you will know this one, all right? Okay. All right, next says, 
Uh, oh, spectator returns the deck, returns the card to the deck and shuffles it. All right, so we'll put it right back in the middle. We'll give them a, a quick little shuffle. You can cut the cards any way you want. You can cut deep, you can cut shallow, you can cut right in the middle, anywhere you'd like. Perfect, put it right beside there. And you could have cut anywhere. Now, the next step says, uh, have the spectator name their card and turn over the card cut to. And before we do that, do you, are you happy with that cut or do you yes. want to cut somewhere else? Happy You're happy. Okay, so spectator named their card. My card was the... Queen of Hearts. Queen of Hearts. And Jake, show everyone exactly where you cut. This card? Yeah. And that is the Queen of Hearts. Jake, that is amazing. That was really good. Have you done this before? No, I haven't. <laughs> well, look, uh, oh, this one has a bonus effect. Do you oh. see this, Nicole? Bonus effect. The bottom card is now the Three of Clubs. <laughs> Go ahead, take a look. <laughs> oh, my God. You guys are too good to do that. These have a, uh, a mathematical principle that uh, somehow just works. Even when you know how it works, it still doesn't make much sense. And there's one more here, it's called the Four Aces. Um, this deck has all of the aces, so uh, it, the first step, Nicole, would you mind being the magician for this one? I would not mind The first all. step says, uh, remove the, uh, place the four aces on top of the deck. So, so look through, take out the four aces. Now this one, I, I could never understand how it works. Uh, even though I know how it works, I, I don't know why it works. It's, it's uh, you'll see what I mean. And you're doing a great job, Nicole. Have you done this before? Never. I didn't think so. <laughs> no, but you're doing great. Now just put the deck down for now. You can hold the cards, uh, hold them face down, just mix them up so you're not sure of the order they're in. No, face down so you can't see them. So you're not sure of the order. All right, and it says, um, place the four aces on top of the deck. Perfect. Step two says, have the spectator, uh, which is me, insert the three aces, the top three aces into different parts of the deck, one at a time. Okay? So we'll go one near the top, one near the middle, and one near the bottom. Just like that. Step three, magician waves the fourth ace over the deck. So magician, you take the last ace, turn it face up, and wave it over the deck. <laughs> and here's the part that gets me. Show the three aces are now back on top of the deck. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that worked every time. But somehow. That was great. And let's make sure there's not more aces. Sometimes um, magicians do sneaky things, but. Uh, you brought your own aces for a second, Nicole. But no, no more aces. Well, let's hear it for Nicole. Great job, Nicole. <laughs>